So, last day of Nitro Rallycross. Uh, yeah, we're in a warm Florida in December, so yeah, looking pretty good. Uh, a lot of people turning up already, and it's a couple hours left till we're racing, so uh, yeah, I'm excited. Should be good. A hot day in Florida with the Gators. The trackers have done a great job. So, the, the first day we, we were running on whatever this is under, and we, and we were struggling. So, they got all this dirt here 2 30 a.m and they, they resurfaced, resurfaced it, so yeah, they done a great job. Long nights for them, I guess, but it, it gets much better yeah, racing when, when we have good. Good morning, guys. Morning. How are you? How are you? Good. good, good, hi. I'm Robert. Kevin. Good to meet you. Good to brother. Brother? Yeah. yeah. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. Have you met Robert before? No, I'm Oliver. Nice Robert. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, well, maybe we can get him into a rally class car. Yeah. Trying. Still trying to convince him. <laughs> There's like indie lights and stuff, so it's a little different. Hey, you gotta learn some Swedish now. Well, I guess that's Travis. He had a deal with Chase Elliott that if Chase came here and drove, Travis would jump out of an airplane as Chase was flying, so I'm pretty sure that is Travis. Yeah, it's much warmer today, so we gotta be more careful about the tires. Um, there's a lot of tarmac on this on this racetrack, so we haven't had that problem yet. So it's pretty new to, to us because it's the first time ever we used these Yokohama tires on tarmac. So it's yeah, we learned some yesterday, but today it's I would say 10, 10 degrees warmer already now. So it will be some some new challenges to, to adapt to that. That track looks great, uh, very similar to yesterday. They just uh, fix some potholes and stuff and fill some barrels uh, so we can't cut as much. Uh, but yeah, very similar to yesterday. So uh, our cars were quick yesterday. So yeah, it's all to play for today. I mean, it's all precision, so it'll be a bit tough fight, but we're speeding the car. So uh, yeah, get everything held together, you know, and don't crash the cars and we should be quick at it. So try the halfway first yeah. to see how it feels and then try all the way out and see how it feels. Yeah. Just don't fuck it up so we can get some good data and see. Like just focus on hitting your marks and not overdriving the entry, right? It's time for uh, Sunday's warm-up. Uh, preparing for the heat, getting some data. Uh, try some different stuff, these two laps we get. So uh, let us go out, see how the car feels. Uh, be, make sure I'm sharp and uh, yeah, let's have some fun. This was good. Uh, the car was set up perfectly, so I just went out, felt it, uh, tried some different lines and stuff. Uh, yeah, we're running quick, so uh, now we just have the long wait, and then we do a whole race in three hours. So uh, it'll be hectic when we get going, but uh, yeah, for now it's pretty calm. So we're calm before the storm, they say. Try, because if we're there, it's too long to go there. Yeah, yeah. So then we have to try to stay yeah. outside. You, you can't be nice. No. You fucking. You let Travis back in yesterday. You should have stuck right on the door. I, I think we, we can't show too early. We need to try to stay and break nice and then just try to get the run. Yeah. And try to like get the open corner more. So not try to show that we want in. Like How far behind is Orbit starting? How far is it? It's not much. No, it's maybe one like, yeah. he, will, he will be very aggressive in yeah. yeah. They just feel the curve inside it. Yep. No pressure, Ali. No pressure. Keep telling me that. Pressure's for tires. Yep. Time to go racing. Uh, a bit tough. Uh, first heat, only one, only the winner moves on to the final. So it's all about position now. So it's going to be some big fights out there. 
starting front row, so I have a good shot for it. Speed is there in the car, so uh, yeah, every millimeter counts now. So yeah, we gotta go out, make the most of it, and get the car in one piece, because if we don't win, it's tied to the semi, so yeah, Let's hit it. moves here, Hansen, Arpin, Bennett all go straight to the standard lap and uh, onto the joke lap underneath has gone Ollie and also Chase Elliott's gone in with him. That's where Scott, Timmy have maybe got a little advantage over Travis. On board for the jump gives you a good idea of the perspective into the left and now wait for the weight transfer, flick it right and then flat out over the next jump the zip recruiter one. Well I'll tell you real quick here, it's not on camera but let's take a look at Ollie Bennett, he tried to go up the jump, he lost speed and he, he's actually just going backwards on the jump. And the gap's going up to Ollie Erickson at every sector. So Jared, Ooh, they're going to leave him out. out. Chase has gone around as well. So the only danger man now for Hansen is Arpin. And he's gapping him just a little bit. More. Yeah, so he's actually gaining. nailed it. Yeah, he's nailed it. So that is the, that's the best lap of today so far in Supercar. And Hansen has put it in just when he needed to, basically, at Joker time. So Ollie Erickson was closer than I thought. Yeah. I think Erickson's actually got past Arpin. But yeah, Timmy, that, that's what they do. So they've been on the spot and said, this is the lap to push. You're going joker next time, no mistakes. And it, it is exactly what Timmy's good at. Arpin and uh, Ericsson coming too close behind Ericsson. Yeah, pretty good heat. I uh, was fighting with Timmy for the win in, in the heat. Uh, came out second, was behind Timmy. So we move on to the semi-finals. I'm uh, in pole position for the semi. So try to control that line, uh, get a good run, and uh, hopefully move on to the final. And then here we are past. Speed three. I know what I need to work. Now I have to adjust my driving there because I don't. When I go to gravel, I don't trust the steering at all. So I, need, I do a little of a pitch, and then it's like you're so close to the barrier. So then I hesitate a bit. So I need to go in, trust the steering more, so I can be more on it. There. Do you need something to give you more confidence? No, or it? it's me. Let's do it then. Chase Elliott is, is not in clear air. Oh, and he gets into the back of Arpin, really lets him know he's there. So Arpin's not getting the turn in that, that Ericsson's getting. It looks like Ericsson's got a quicker car underneath him, but he's got to get through Jarrett on the coverage yeah. position. Whoa. Oh, spin! Hold on to it, Brad. Light it up! Oh, I don't know what happens. <laughs> yeah. Gets back. Gets back in line. Hey, so Oli Bennett's all right. Meanwhile, Luke, we've got an absolute ding dong going on between Ericsson and McConnell in the OMC Fiestas. I don't know. Ericsson's got, a he's got the rear left tyres off. I wonder why he got back. They were 10 seconds up the road, Jared. He shouldn't have been at the merge with Braz. He should have been clear in front. Look, there's the tyre off, and Chase Elliott's going to go through as well. He squeezes Chase. But Ollie can't hold on to that. He might as well give up the position. Yeah. And Fraser McConnell, why the Jamaican flag is in the final. We were initially red flag. Arpin couldn't make the jump. Doran goes in the back of Ollie. Ollie, I don't know how Frenin got damaged. That back left puncture. Fraz McConnell, Chase Elliott going for it. I don't know. It's just this season. It's, it's, what happened? Everything that can go wrong goes wrong. Wishbone breaks, I get puncture, and I don't know. So 
Front row. Yeah, it's... Listen. I have to be at those two. You got nothing to lose. Fucking put your elbows out and go to the front. It's the last race of the year. You got nothing to say. You got no reprep to do. You got to get to the front. That's the only way to the final. Yeah. Yep. On the front row, they've both been quick today. Who's going to get the best start? Wheel spin from both cars on the run down to the first corner. McConnell maybe slightly ahead, but he doesn't have the inside. Look at the trunk around the outside. They do the dust and clean up. McConnell gets the whole shot. Where's he going to go? Straight to the Joker lap. Oh, and into the standard lap. Ericsson gets a little shot from behind by Tanner Faust in the 34. They all clear over the jump. Liam Doran up behind Oli Ericsson. Five cars Clear on the standard lap. What's absolutely crucial now is whether the others go or not. I think they'll have to wait for it. Tanner down. Faust goes. Faust has gone to try and cover him off. I think McConnell again. Oh, it's McConnell dropped it in turn one. Good job, you're on your own. Someone dropped in turn one. It's Fraser McConnell's gone off in the first corner. The car's parked in the dust. He had a spin in turn one. It's all over for him. Tanner Faust, that seven second split, but both the Ericsons, Kevin and Ollie, are one and two. Look at it, the gap closes. Tanner Faust, he's going to have to work hard. So there's Fraser parked on the outside of turn two. He's absolutely gutted in the car. Ah, oh. oh, there you go. Braz, we feel for you, mate. Fight, it fight. was on. Everybody knows how fast you are, mate. It just hasn't gone. It hasn't come together. Here we go. Let's go, Joker. They have Tanner to Faust, the final lap. Here we go, so the Ericsson's going for the joke the last year, Tanner Faust clear shot. him. The spotter is here saying go Tanner for it, Tanner Faust three. takes the lead from the Ericsson's. Brilliant drive by Faust, the Ericsson's saying two. it should be clear, 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 you're clear by two, that's two. Look at Kevin, he is already breathing down the neck of Tanner Faust, one of the best American rally cross no drivers ever. Ever. So Tanner Faust is going to take that last spot in the final, it sweeps it around the left-hander, Ericsson trying to line him up to out, okay, down the straight, the up and over the tabletop, they jump back in now, Tanner Faust going to take job. the last We're spot in the final. In the final. Last race uh, didn't end as we wanted. Uh, we missed out on the final uh, again. Uh, had some crashing in the semi-final and the LCQ. Yeah, we got a bit of traffic and yeah, we didn't make it through. And it's kind of been the red line through the whole season. Car has been great, performance has been great, but yeah, the results has just not been there. So that's too bad. Uh, been all around a, a great Nitro rallycross season. We had a lot of fun. Uh, personally, the most fun I've ever had in a race car uh, in rallycross ever. Uh, tracks have been amazing and everything, so yeah, it's been fun. Yeah, and we're back home here now in, in Mooresville. Uh, I didn't have my best weekend either uh, in Florida, sadly. I wanted to end the season on a high. Uh, we've been there, we've been fighting with the top guns, uh, so it would have been nice to to finish off strong, but sadly not. But I'm very happy with the season, how how it went. Uh, we showed very, very good pace. We were always up there, I would say. Uh, got the Honda back back in, in the fight. So uh, it's been a very fun season with Nitro Rallycross and I can't wait to be back for more. Uh, but that's it for this video. But don't miss out. Next video, we will be out doing some go-kart, uh, watching some basketball stuff me and Oliver do as much as we can when, while we are here in the USA at our, uh, at our parents' house. So don't miss that.